Hey guys, welcome back to FedEx Gaming's Redstone Tutorials. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you guys how to build a revolving lighthouse. So we go down here and let's click the button on our makeshift lighthouse that I made. And our lighthouse should start revolving. There we go, it's going around. <laughs> so the one thing I love about my lighthouse is it's an actual circle. Most revolving lighthouses you see are not circles and I don't know why that annoys me, but it just does. So I, I actually made mine a perfect circle. And also I'm not gonna be showing you guys how to build this lighthouse. I know it's stupid looking, but we're only here to learn how to build the little revolving part up here at the top. So what I'm gonna do is switch it to daytime now and we're gonna learn how to build this thing. And also let me turn it off real quick because you can turn it off. So. Boop, it's off. <laughs> All right, guys, so let's start building this thing. All right, guys, so for this build, we're going to need a five by five spacing. Obviously, we're gonna need more than that, but we're suspended in, in midair, guys. We're in the air, so you should have way more than enough space to do anything. So for this build, we're going to need at least 20 redstone repeaters, at least 20 redstone dust, 72 redstone lamps. That's as much as you're gonna need, 72 lamps, at least eight redstone torches, two sticky pistons, some blocks to put our redstone down on. We're also gonna need a button and a lever. And actually, I'm gonna take out a few different colors as well for certain different areas. So let's take out yellow as well. Now, the reason why I say at least is because it really depends on how you're gonna get the power to your lamps. Like down here, I have the button and the lever and the thing is all the way up there. So what all I did was I just put a redstone, uh, a little torch tower going all the way up to the top. That's why I said it really depends on how much stuff you're really gonna need if you want your power to go to the bottom or if you're gonna actually have it so people can go up into your, red, your uh, <laughs> lighthouse and turn it on from the top. So like I said, that really all depends on you. So once you got your five by five spacing, what we're gonna do is in the middle of every single five, we're gonna put a block. So just put a block here, 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 and here in the middle of every single five. And then we're gonna put a torch on top of every single one of them. Now, like I said, a, a redstone, uh, I mean, a lighthouse usually won't be this small. It really just depends on how high you wanna bring the, the thing up. So next, what we're gonna do is pretty much make a clock. That's all we're gonna do, make a clock going all the way around this thing. So pick any single torch, doesn't really matter where you start from, and put a four tick delay repeater coming out of the block, then just put a block in front of it, then put a four tick going back into it like this, and pretty much do that the whole way around to make a nice little clock. So four ticks, block, four ticks, four ticks, block, four ticks. Ah, I'm getting mixed up, <laughs> four ticks, block and four ticks. And there we go. That will make a clock right here. It'll go around in a circle very nicely. And to send the power to it, what we're gonna do is actually, I'm gonna delete this little middle area. So it really, like I said, it depends on how like big you're gonna make your lighthouse, how wide you're gonna make it. I don't know what you're doing, but to get the power to it, like to start it, what I like to do is start from any torch in the middle. doesn't really matter. Put a block out from it, put dust on the block, come down another block off the dust like that. Put another piece of dust coming down from there. And then we're gonna make a repeater go into this block, set it to, actually, you know what? Let's just do this. Let's put a piece of dust here, come down a block and then put a repeater going into the dust on four ticks delay like that. Then put a sticky piston behind the four tick delay repeater with a block on top of it. That will create a monostable circuit. Delete this block underneath this torch. Put a block going next to this sticky piston with a repeater on one tick delay. So now if we send any power to this one tick delay repeater right here, it will start up our lighthouse. So if we put a button right here and click it, as you can see, the torches are going on and off creating an infinite circuit loop around the whole thing. So now when we want to turn it off, now just pick, like I said, pick any one of these blocks around these corners right here. It doesn't really matter which one you pick. We're just going to come down three blocks from it. So let's take out our, let's use Red Wolf for it. The reason, I just want to get this out of the way. I want to get the easy part, the hard, uh, easy part out of the way before we actually start doing the lighthouse. So like, I'm going to pick this block right here since it's right next to the button. And I'm going to come three blocks down from this. So one, two, three delete the two middle blocks and then put a sticky piston facing upwards towards this block right here. And then any power going to this sticky piston will turn it off. So if I put a lever to the block right underneath it and I flip it down, it will turn it off. So ready? And it turns off. There we go. So now we got the on and off working. So now we're actually, we're gonna have to do is actually build the lighthouse itself. So now it's gonna start getting a little tough. So let's start building this lighthouse. So on every on torch right here, what we're gonna do is put a block right above every on torch. Just put a block right above each one of them, like so. And then we're gonna put another torch right above them. These torches will go off like that. And then put a block right above every off torch. So block here, 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 and come on. 
that there we go <laughs> and then we're gonna come one block out from every off torch like this so just come out from every off torch one block like that and like that there we go and then out of every block that's right above each off torch we're gonna put a repeater going this way on one tick delay then next to every single repeater we're gonna put another block like so so we're pretty much gonna make like a T kind of looks like a T from up top so put a block next to each repeater on one tick delay like that making T's around the whole thing kind of actually looks like an iron cross a little bit I don't know why and next what we're gonna do is put dust right next to each repeater like so now what I want you to do is actually just take out any block doesn't really matter we're, we're not really gonna be doing much with them but we're just gonna put uh, make a square around the whole thing next to every off torch so right next to the off torch is what I want you to do is come over a block over and over like that just make a square going around the whole thing like this this will just help us get a few extra repeaters in later on there we go so it should look something like that make a nice little square going around the whole thing next to every off torch and now we're going to start putting our lamps in so right off the block that the dust and the repeaters on we're going to put three lamps and then we're going to put another three lamps and another three lamps so there should be nine lamps in front of every single t so do that around every single one of them three three and three do the same thing here three three and three one more time three three and three there we go Next, what we're going to do is make the corners. So to make the corners, it's actually very simple. All we're going to do is right next to this dust right here, come up three. Right next to this dust, come up three. And then right in the middle of them, come up three like that. So it should look something like that. And do the same thing on every single side. So one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One more time. Well, two more times, actually. One, two, three. One, two, three. And one, two, three. One more time. One, two, three. One, two, three one two three so there we go now we got our perfect circle now in every single one of these dust right here where every single dust is we're going to put a repeater going into the block that the dust is on that's why i put these blocks right here so we're going to put a repeater going into that one repeater going into that one do it to every single one of them repeater 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 like that now we're gonna have to do some ticks here so when we're looking at one set of them this is one set of repeaters right here the one to the furthest to the right right here is going to be on three ticks and the one furthest to the left is going to be on two ticks like that so it should be three one and two and do that all the way around so three one and two three one and two three one and two so our lighthouse is going to be revolving this way like this it's going to be revolving counterclockwise like that if yours is clockwise then it's going to be the opposite way if yours is going clockwise then it's going to be three one and two going this way However, whichever way your lighthouse is revolving, like mine's revolving this way, it's going to be three, one, two. If yours is revolving this way, then it's going to be three, one, and two that way. <laughs> Just giving you guys a heads up. I don't want your lighthouse to look weird while it's revolving. <laughs> That's why. So next, what we're going to actually do now is off of every single off torch right here, we're going to put dust on top of the block. And then what we're going to do is come over a block to the left and then come down a block like that and do that to every single one of them. And then put dust on it actually put dust on it like that and then these two dusts are going to connect we do not want this to happen so we're going to put a block here so like i said if yours is going clockwise then yours is actually going to be going this way you're going to have the dust here and have it come down a block over here if yours is going clockwise it's going to go this way like i said i don't want you guys to get confused whichever way you're depending on but if you're building it the same exact way i'm building it right now then you shouldn't have this problem so i'm just going to put this back right here like that and then we're gonna put a block back here and it's gonna cut it off. And we're gonna do the same thing around each side. So come over a block, put dust right here. These two will connect. Just put a block here to disconnect them and then come down a block. And just do that to every single side. So down one, put dust right here, here and here. Put a block here to cut that off. And one more time, over one to the left, down one, put dust right here, here and here. Put a block here to cut it off and you are done that's it you are completely done actually let me get rid of that that looks weird <laughs> so we are completely done so now if i click the button down here it should start up our lighthouse there you go you got the perfect looking light going around the whole entire thing very nicely and then when we're ready to turn off our lighthouse we just click this down our lighthouse goes off and we can click it back up so there you guys go that's how you build my revolving lighthouse if you enjoyed this video make sure to leave it a like and subscribe to stay tuned with my newest videos. All right, guys. Peace.